Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. Um, we just finished taking on the Midgar Zolom and getting our butts kicked. Um, yep, like that. Um, well, all these alls are really not necessary. Uh, we'll put on Chaco and Mog, that way we get to show that off. Um... And the chocolate is the right one to start to level that up. Not that it's necessary at all. Actually, it's not necessary at all. Um, no, we'll put, put that one back on. That looks nice. A lot of attention. I can't think of a better way to arrange these because I don't like the way that looks. Aha, uh aha, -huh, uh -huh, bam. Yes, I'm literally that OCD. <laughs> That's terrible. Did I even give him back the material that I wanted to put on him? Okay, good. <laughs> Alright, so first things first, guys. The most important thing you can do is come in here and if you put on select, which is, I think, the only way you would figure this out. Although, same thing with that last Chocobo. Um, if you don't talk to it with a okay, It'll never work. But you get one of the most important materials in the game called Long Range. Now, now I'm in trouble. Alright, two fires I definitely don't need. That has 14. You have 11. Now everything's just all messed up. Now it I also forgot about summon materia. So, actually, here, Cloud alone has one of every type of materia in the game. You have magic materia, which we're all familiar with. Um, we have support materia, and support materia um, literally does exactly what it sounds like. It supports whatever materia it's linked to. Um, generally, it only works with magic materia. There is later support materia that you get that can support command independent or summon materia. Um, summon materia is just like magic materia. Um, it gives you something you can use. Um, the number of stars is the amount of times that you can summon per battle. Um, independent materia is exactly what it's supposed to be. Is that it is independent. It works on its own. It never needs to be joined. It can never get a benefit from being joined. Anything like that. Um, and then last but not least is command materia, which gives you additional commands for your character. And, I mean, that's just easiest, like, I mean, in this case, yes, this is actually a magic command materia, which is a little weird. But we get other command materials, such as steel and sense, which don't follow that same pattern. So, um... Why is he in the back? I don't understand why Red 13's in the back. Oh, I know why he's in the back. Um, yes, so let's move on. Um, there is a creature I want to fight up in this area, uh, both for stealing... No, I think the stealing one's in the other one. There's a few monsters that I need to play with in this area, and we already found one of them. There it is. Right off the bat, learned enemy skill flamethrower. So now we have this magnificent flamethrower. Crap, I think I just. Yes, attack the lion. Oh, nice, I didn't attack the lion. So that dragonfly in the back row, he's actually immune to fire and absorbs it. I don't remember what I'm trying to steal from I thought it was worth like a potion or something. Or an ether. But yeah, if we hold this screen right here before okaying it, her limit break doesn't actually go off immediately. 
One of the few limit breaks that when you select it, it doesn't go off instantaneously. Whoops. But, nice easy finish. What, Red 13 to start gaining limit breaks because he has the most amazing one. Er, not the most, but... But he has some really awesome ones that I want to show off. And this sled bang I find more. <laughs> Awesome, again, it's one of those things, awesome the first time you see it, and then boring every time after. You know what, if I can steal from this thing, I will show off Chaku and Bob. But yeah, those things are ironically weak to fire, and then the thing in the back is weak to ice. So, like many... Yeah, just eat them, it's okay, that's what I thought. Wild turn, there we go, so summon Chaco Mog. And I think this thing will survive. That is now off line. So here's Chaco Mog, guys. Or one of two. <laughs> Boom! <laughs> so that's a Mog, by the way, and then obviously the Chaco is riding it. And that's a good old sled fan. So that is your wind elemental damage in the game. I think it is the only wind elemental damage in the game. Ooh, there we go. Lunatic High. Lovely. Awesome. Um, that'll be actually really fun to show off. Probably a bit more practical as well. But yeah, now you can see that Cloud's actually using up magic pretty frequently, both between um, summons and enemy skills. Those are kind of like the big two that you waste most of your magic on. Um, as well as healing the party, and he's actually kind of running slightly low on magic. Not terribly low, but he's getting there. Um, come up here. Alright, there's an enemy in this room I need to find and steal from, or fight and steal from. And it sucks because their attack is terrible, so you can't even grind off them. But here they are. Exactly what I was looking for. Thing. From what I remember, they're not that powerful either. Like, they don't have a lot of HP. Um, you know what? We'll just use a little break. He's probably dead. Just like Tifa, all they want. That was fine. Yeah, besides Red 13 not having command material, this is actually like my party setup. Is that I'll have one physical attacker, which in this case is Tifa for some reason. Darn it. Mess that up, and I think I killed him. Yep, I killed him. So I need to find those again real fast, and then we can get moving on. Um, but I'd like to have my steel or my um, command materia show up on the right. And the way that the game will always prioritize it is that magic will always be your second option, summons will always be your third option, item will always be that bottom fourth option, and then command materials usually go in the remaining places. And I do say it that way because there are certain ones that are to the side and there are some that take over other slots. So how many of these things do you get Yeah, nothing to do. And these things are weak as This seems to be doing the most coverage, which I think is like great, but odd. I'm actually hoping that they'll attack Cloud, and I don't think they're going to. I was going to set up Cloud's blade beam to kill off multiple enemies, but they killed the first one off too fast. Oh well, for the rest. So 
So yeah, this is, I guess, maybe like all the potions that I've saved up so far. Maybe I should just be using them, like spamming them in here. But, whoops. I don't see the point in that because magic... I mean, guys, it's magic. Why wouldn't you use it? But yeah, so Cloud, um, that purple material I gave him long range is exactly what it sounds like. It allows him to do the same damage whether or not he's front range or long range. So if you have a melee party that you really like and don't want in the back line... Thank you, Red. Unnecessary, but thank you. Come on, just give him a double chance. That's all I'm asking. No, that's so close. What a tease. Okay, so I need to hit the one in the top right. I want to show this off. R really, game? Oh, it's fine. Tifa, you can steal. You can steal. This view, this angle. Just have to take Cloud. No, we'll even put him in the back row. That way he takes less damage. All oh, right, you're supposed to let that go through. All right. If I remember correctly, I think that's the one that got missed. So this is how your limit breaks are supposed to work. Kill your target, and everything else gets affected and damaged by it. And everything dies. That is the best way to farm up limit breaks. So specifically, up oh, and perfectly said, Cloud has already hit. I've yet to give him a single fury the entire game, and he's already hitting his second stage limit breaks frequently. <laughs> Yeah, once you get Blade Beam for Cloud, I mean, I, I literally feel like the game... Like, I feel bad. This is still the first, like, 5-10% of the game. And Cloud's already more than halfway done on a summon break. Why is he messaging me on Skype? Yo, dude, what's up? I'm recording. Eventually, guys, I'm going to steal this, and you're going to see why I'm going out of my way. Because so far, every time I go out of my way, I'm stealing equipment for some 